hello everyone welcome back to my channel and i hope you all are doing great uh, so today the weather over here is completely cold i'm and i'm going to show you the weather temperature over here it's uh 16 degree today i'm gonna make a traditional chutney in a traditional way in a traditional style in my garden so i'm going to show you my garden this is my garden this is the one which i'm going to make chutney and uh, in Khasi, we do call this one Sobaingon Deng or Sobaingon Peleng. But in English, I have no idea what we call this. It's just similar with tomato. Now I'm going to show you the ingredients, what we need to make this chutney. We need garlic, onion, coriander, salt to taste, and this chili. This is a very small chili and it's very spicy and hot and we call it in Khasi Sotman Ken Knai. So I'm gonna make this chutney in a petal. So first of all I'm gonna burn this over here and we call it here in Khasi Shaula. We have to burn this till it completely becoming black and then we have to peel off the skin. Onion, I'm gonna cut it into small cube pieces. I'm gonna cut it in very thin. I'm going to make it a little bit spicy. Onion is done. You can see it's completely burned. So I'm going to take it out and put it in a plate. And I have to leave this for... 5 to 10 minutes to cool it down. Now it's completely cold, so I'm gonna peel off the skin. And it's very soft. So I'm going to crush this garlic.
and now I'm gonna add this chili it's a very small chili And I'm gonna crush this chili with garlic. I think I'm gonna add more chili. I want to have it sp spicy. So now I'm gonna add this sabayngon ding or sabayngon peleng in a petal. I'm gonna crush this as well. And now I'm going to add onions. And then and I'm gonna add salt to taste and finally I'm gonna add coriander Mix it properly. I'm gonna add more coriander. Now it's done, so I'm gonna take it and put it in a bowl. I'm gonna take it and put it in a bowl. Now it's done and it's ready.
So I'm going to taste a little bit. It's very spicy and it's too tasty and yummy. Hope you guys like my recipe and my video. Please do remember to like, comment, share and subscribe my channel. And do not forget to click on the bell icon so that you will not miss any video which I post. So see you guys in my next video. Take care guys. Bye.